All right. Um, in class yesterday, we had a little problem. We wanted to concatenate two uh, finite state automatons. We have this A plus B star A in blue here, and we have this B, A, B, A plus B star in red here. And hopefully you still have your notes and you can see what those automatons are. But we got this one and this one, which you're just going to have to uh, accept if you haven't already done this, that these are correct. And we want to concatenate them. So what we're going to try to do is basically bridge these two and put them next to each other. So we're going to try to end up with this expression that's A plus B star, A, B, A plus B star. So there's something with an A, B in the middle. It's got to have an AB in the middle. And the way that we did it in class was we took these states and we started with uh, state number one here. And we said, well, where can we go from, from state one? Well, we can go, if we do an A, we'll go to state uh, two or three. And uh, if we go over the B, we're going to stay at one. And then we, we mapped this all out. You know, we have, went from 2, 3 now. We said, well, from 2, 3, we can go to 2 if it's an A, or 5 if it's a A on this one here. And then with B, it would be 1 or 4. B would be 1, and then it would be a 4. Those would be the two possible states. Now, what happened was, when we did this whole thing out, we got to this expression here. We, we, we got this whole state. This should be a deterministic finite state automaton here. Um, and we said, well, you know, here we go from 1 to 2, 3. You know, just like it says here. We mapped it all out. And we said, hey, wait a second. What about AAB? AAB is acceptable, but in this one, it goes A, A, and then it's never in an accepting state. Remember that these are the two accepting states that have fours in them. And so, what happened? Well, <clears throat> turns out it's not quite as easy as this. Um, this, isn't quite ex this isn't quite the way it's supposed to be done, from what I saw. And let me just try to explain the way that I've seen it done. I'm going to redo this. And all this too. And we're going to start from scratch using a different, a different technique here. Well, similar technique, but a little bit different. Basically, we have a state, and we have instead of A B, we have A B. Oh gosh, Georgie. I can write the letter B. And lambda star. Basically, this, this gives us a transitions from a non-deterministic uh, finite state machine, NFA, to a, uh, a deterministic automaton. So basically, each of these are deterministic, but the two of them together are non-deterministic. Whenever you have a lambda in here, it's non-deterministic. So, so basically, we have non-deterministic system here, and we're going to force this into being a deterministic system. And we're just going to we're going to do the same thing we were doing before: combine states. But watch this: we're using this now. We're using a different. Um, we're adding this lambda star in here. So just check this out with me. Uh, where can we use here? We use orange. Okay, so state number one is going to be our initial state, right? So there's no problem there. From one, where can we go if we go if we take the A path? <clears throat> where can we go? Two. If we um, take the B path, one. Right? From one we go to A. It goes to two. B goes here. If we take the lambda path, there's really no lambda path, but Whenever you take lambda, you can always stay where you're at. 
Now this is the trick right here. This is how this is how I've seen it done. Uh, <clears throat> so now we have one goes to two, one or one, depending if it's a, b, or lambda star. So let's take. We now have steps two. So we got to add that into there. So let's try two now. From two, from two, if we take an a, where does it go? It stays at two. If we take a b, it goes to one. If we take a lambda star, it goes to two or three. Lambda star means could be zero lambdas also. So you have two, three there. The lambda star is always going to have itself in there. Uh, the, the same state you're coming from. So that's that. Now, <clears throat> now we have um, from step three. We're going to go to from step from from stage three. We can go if we take an A, we can go to five, and if we take a B, we're going to go to four. And if we take a, a lambda star, I'm not going anywhere. This lamp just stays at three. And then if four, well, you know what? I don't know why I circled these. Four, you're going to go, if, if it's an A or a B, you still go to four. For A, B, or Lambda, no matter what, you're, you're in the spin zone down here. And uh, sync, or whatever you want to call it. And then <clears throat> 5, same thing, 5, 5, 5. Okay? So this is kind of an intermediate table to get us where we're getting to. Okay, so this is the non-deterministic transition table. Okay, now we want to create a deterministic transition table. Let's do this by eliminating the lambdas. We've got the states, and we have A lambda star and B lambda star. Remember that, of course, in lambda star, it always includes the state you're coming from. That's an important thing to remember. Let's see what we got here. So from state 1, which is our initial state, where can we go in this transition table here? Where can we go? From 1, if we go to A lambda star, we can go to 2 or 1. Sorry, no, 2. Yeah, 2 or 1. Okay? So it, what we do is we look for 2 or 1 on this table, and we, we check the A first, which is 2, right? And then we go to the lambda star. 2 lambda star is 2, 3. So it's 2, 3. This is the trick. Okay? We're going from A lambda star. A is 2, 2 is lambda star, 2, 3 is our answer here. We'll, we'll go through a couple more of these, but that's what's happening. For B lambda star, we go to this one, 1, 1, which is 1, and lambda star is 1. You see? So we're going B lambda star. So now we have state 2, 3, and we have state 1, which we already had state, state 1 anywhere here. So now let's try um, going from 2, 3. Well, from 2, 3, we go A, 2, and 3. A takes us to 2 or 5. And then lambda star, we go to 2 lambda stars, 2, 3, 5 lambda stars, 5. So we have 2, 3, 5. Tricky? <laughs> All you're really doing is you're going to A lambda star following these, tr these transitions on this non-deterministic table. We're putting it into a deterministic table. So, 2, 3, if you do A lambda star, you go to 2, 3, 5. If you do B lambda star, 2 and 3, if B is 1 and 4, Lambda star 1 and 4 is 1 and 4. That is the deterministic method. Same, same thing here. If you go here, we now we have 2, 3, 5. 
that's a state, and then we have 1 4, that's a state. So let's go there, let's do, if we go from 2 3 5, we have 2 3 5, sorry, 2 3 5, and we're going to go A. A is going to be 2 5 5, so 2 5. Then we have 2 and 5, we go to lambda star, we have 2 3 5 again. 2 3 5. That's A lambda star. From 2, 3, 5, doing B lambda star, it's 2, 3, 5. B is 1, 4, 5. And 1, 4, 5 lambda star, 1, 4, 5 lambda star is 1, 4, 5 again. See the lambda star column. So here we got 1, 4, 5. So the 2, 3, 5 we already have, but now we've got to add state 1, 4, 5. Uh, so now we'll, let's try 1, 4. 1, 4, 1, and 4. If you go to A lambda star, A is 2, 4. And lambda star and 2, 4 is 2, 3, 4. So 2, 3, 4 is now where we go 2, 3, 4 here. And uh, with 1, 4, B... Lambda star, 1 and 4, we go to B, is still 1 and 4 again. Lambda star is 1 and 4 again. So that's just 1, 4. And then we've got to add 1, 4. Uh, no, we got 1, 4 right here. we got 2, 3, 4 down here. Now, 1, 4, 5. From 1, 4, 5, we have 1, 4, 5. A is 2, 4, 5. Lambda star of 2, 4, 5 is 2, 3, 4, 5. 2, 3, 4, 5. And, uh, and then 1, 4, 5, B lambda star is going to be 1, 4, 5. B is 1, 4, 5 again. Lambda star of 1, 4, 5 is 1, 4, 5. About that. Now we got uh, uh, two, three, four from up here that we got to do. Oh, we, we also got two, three, four, five. We got to add that one. Two, three, four, five. And um, but here, two, three, four. Let's do two, three, four. If we go from two, three, four, two, three, four, a lambda star is going to be a. 2, 3, 4 is 2, 5, 4. Okay. And the two, lambda star of 2, 5, 4 is 2, 3, 4, 5. So 2, 3, 4, 5. That's A lambda star on this, on this um, deterministic table here. Now if we go from 2, 3, 4 and we go B lambda star, where does that take us? 2, 3, 4. B lambda star. 2, 3, 4. B is 1, 4. And lambda star of 1, 4 is 1, 4. 2, 3, 4. Yeah, 1, 4. 2, 3, 4, B lambda star. 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 4. Yep. Lambda star of 1, 4 is 1, 4. Yes. So, <clears throat> now we've got to do 2, 3, 4, 5. If you have 2, 3, 4, 5... A lambda star is going to be 2, 4, 5. A is 2, 4, 5. Lambda star of 2, 4, 5 is 2, 3, 4, 5. And, uh, and then B lambda star from 2, 3, 4, 5 is 2, 3, 4, 5. B, 1, 4, 5. Lambda star of 1, 4, 5 is... One, four, five. So let me, I think, the, I think I went off the screen here. Let me go ahead and zoom in on this bad devil. Oh, you can see it? Yeah, you can see it, kind of. Oh my gosh, it's it. <laughs> this, is the, this is the deterministic table. So, here, let me just fix this up here. Ba -do -do -do. So now we can 
now we can draw this um, table. Let's do it. Let's do it. What color should we use? How about black? So now we can just draw this thing. Here we go. We got one. And from one we go to two, three. If it's two, three. If it's an A, we go to two, three. If it's a B, we go to one. And uh, if it's uh, two, three, if it's an A, we go to two, three, five. And then if it's a, a B, we go to one, four. Here we got two, three, five. If we uh, go from two, three, five, and it's an A, we stay at two, three, five. And if it's a B, we go to one, four, five. Oops. Little case of dyslexia there. Uh, now if we go to uh, one, four. If it's an A, we go to two, three, four. And if it's a B, we go back to one, four. And then if we go to one, four, five, one, four, five. If it's a A, we go to two, three, four, five. And if it's a B, we go to one four. And if we're at two, three, four, five, if it's an A, we stay where we're at. And if it's a B, we go to one four five. And for two, three, four, if it's a B, we go to one four also. That my friends is the answer that we were looking for. Now, <clears throat> what are the accepting... We know the initial state is 1. What's the accepting state? Got to have a 4 in it. So any of these that have a 4 in it, all of those are accepting states. That means this one, this one, this one, this one. How about that, eh? So, so now, remember when we were wondering, what about AAB? Well, in this one, we have A, A, and if it's a B, it goes to an accepting state. I think if you test this out, you will find that the concatenation of a plus B star A, B, A, B star. These, this, this, this entire expression here, this is, this is the uh, automaton for that. It can be reduced and everything like that, but this is, this is the, the method by which you can uh, get a, from a, a DFA, George, a deterministic finite state automaton, to an, uh, sorry, from an NFA, excuse me. This is how you get from a non-deterministic to a deterministic. I don't know how many more of these videos I'm going to be able to do, but that, that was, this was kind of a hard one. But I think, I hope this helped you to understand the method by which you can go from a non-deterministic to a deterministic. Uh, automaton. Hope that helps.